This future can only be realized if we work together, work together to create an environment where all can prosper and succeed, and where coercion and conflict are put aside in favor of open dialogue. This requires a continued commitment to certain foundational principles that have enabled this region's success for generations. These include free and open commerce, a just international order that emphasizes rights and responsibilities of nations, and fidelity to the rule of law, open access by all to the domains of sea, air, space, and now cyberspace, and the principle of resolving conflict without the use of force. Threats to these principles are threats to peace and security in the 21st century. Unfortunately, some nations continue to dismiss these values and pursue a disruptive path, most notably North Korea. The United States has been committed to ensuring peace and stability on the Korean Peninsula for 60 years. That means deterring North Korean aggression and protecting our allies and achieving the complete denuclearization of the Korean Peninsula. The United States will not stand by while North Korea seeks to develop a nuclear-armed missile that can target the United States. The United States has been clear that we will take all necessary steps to protect our homeland and our allies from dangerous provocations, including significantly bolstering our missile defense throughout the Pacific. No country should conduct business as usual with a North Korea that threatens its neighbors. We are working closely with our Republic of Korea and Japanese allies to strengthen our posture and ability to respond to threats from North Korea. The prospects for a peaceful resolution also will require close coordination with China. 